so an update on what I've done. Uh, on Wednesday, I watched, well, I watched 13 episodes of Sweet Tooth, and it didn't make any sense why it was called Sweet Tooth. It was just the name of this boy, but it was very, very interesting because it was about these hybrid kids who were being born, um, and it was basically like human babies were no longer being born, and it was only just hybrids being born. Um, but it, I don't like, I, I liked that because it kind of reminded me of like the, the, the Neanderthals versus the Homo sapiens, you know, there's kind of like a, a war that goes on between the sort of the, the more newer version of humans versus the older version that were a little bit stupider. Um, but I, what I didn't like about this film is that um, the, the last humans were like really horrible, kind of vile people um, that were after like desperately after these kids wanting to kill them and it just doesn't make any sense you know it's not realistic i like programs to be realistic and i think if humans just stopped giving birth to humans and every single person born um was sort of half human half animal um you know i i think there'd be a huge amount of shock and i think there'd also be a huge amount of respect for this this new change you know they would see it as god's god doing this that's what they would see it as so they wouldn't go around desperately trying to kill these people even to the point of losing your own life in the process um and so yeah it was, it was i liked i like watching it because i i felt like it's changed and you know there's a, a big difference a big change is coming to in the show um but i didn't like it because i i felt like it was just like why are you so desperate to kill children i mean these are children why are you killing children and i don't know even making jokes about oh you're half human half pig you know i'm your bacon i'm gonna eat you for breakfast i mean who would make jokes about that talking to you know it's, it's one thing to talk about an animal but animals they don't talk and they kept saying oh oh this is a special boy you know the deer boy is a special one because he talks but it was like they they kind of all talk you know that like some of them didn't but a huge portion of them did speak it's just not that there wasn't maybe their language wasn't as fluent as, as the others but um but yeah it, it was it didn't make any sense um and there was you know this this cure that oh death be trying to find a cure for but they were all just relying on one person and and then when they found out there's this disease going around and when people got the disease they would like burn their whole houses down i mean that doesn't make any sense i mean with with the whole human like 99 percent of the population is supposed to be dead um they wouldn't be burning houses because well you can live in houses houses are nice you know there's lots of stuff in it they almost burnt all the information about the the, the d disease that the cure the cure that they're looking for you know because that was in the house and they were just going to burn i don't know there, there was lots of flaws in the story it was interesting watching it but it there was lots of flaws um i then i watched I, I did watch both of the seasons um like all i don't know it's like 20 episodes or something i watched them eventually um and i went to the tamworth valentine spa which was amazing i'm really happy i did a two hour cycle a two and a half hour cycle from birmingham center to tamworth um and then i found out the bus is only two pounds so i did that just, well i didn't do that to say because i i wanted to do the, the cycle ride but now that i know it's only two pounds to get there and back i'm going to be making more i'm going to be making more rounds and, and going to that gym a lot more often um and and then today i have been re going over my website i um have a, a big brother plan idea and i like to fantasize about it and um i know i did a plan last summer um and i wanted to just see like if anything's been changed or anything and i, I kind of realized i haven't probably written it down properly um I, there were some things that i i should have focused more on like the stages should be more about you know getting working with the celebrities or bringing them in or meeting them so that there needs to be a stage where i actually meet them behind closed doors because you know if they if they are going to be supporting me or whatever you know they need to first meet me um i don't know if they really want to or anything but um i, I don't know but I, i've done the stages a little bit better um and i've tried to be less specific um you know i feel like there needs to be a sacrifice um of some kind because there's going to be a lot of people that hate me for my religion or want me dead um and then i feel like there needs to be a show for those people but i don't know what happens it's it's up to them you know that's what the sort of big brother show is about putting on a show that people want to watch that will draw people in um 
and I, I don't think people really want to believe that there's a there's a new Christ on earth but at the same time I am Christ so um that needs that needs to happen but yeah as for what happens in the details and stuff I, I don't know um but I've, I've put a few more suggestions it's you know it won't be me that's doing it um and maybe it won't be anything like that um I know Big Brother is there's, there's a potent there's a one in October in England and um I don't know if I'm going to be on it um I haven't heard anything and it might I'm I might not be um but I I, I feel like looking back at the plan, I was thinking that I, I go in first as a normal human being onto like a normal show. Um, and well, because it's on ITV2, which is supposed to be a channel that's kind of more for replays or, or shows that are less um, less promoted. Um, you know, I feel like that's a sign that it's not going to be a very big show. But then again, that is sort of fitting in with um, how I think I should enter. You know, I, I believe that there's thousands of people who know and I've got huge amount of celebrities I don't know if watch I doubt they're watching all my videos because I make quite long videos and stuff but um I know that they know about me through whatever through Martin or whoever um and uh, yeah I feel like if I just went on a big brother show and was on there for you know four to six weeks just being a normal person and, and not talking about my religion you know it would hide the truth about what I think people know or some people know um and then I go, um, I, I, I then after four weeks perhaps start say, saying it. I mean, if it starts in the beginning of October, um, I guess one, I, the timing could be that I go on in the end, the last week of September, which is the Feast of Tabernacles. Um, and then I go into the Big Brother house as a normal person for a month. Um, and then on Halloween, I tell people in the house that I think I'm Christ and the reasons why. Um, and then like a week or two later, um, I have the show finished. I'll need some sort of immunity card to stop myself from being voted out first. Cause I, I, I've got a feeling that people w would want me out for some reason, whatever, whatever reason. Um, but yeah, um, I probably need an immunity to prevent that from happening. And then when I do leave at the end, I don't have to win it or anything. I'm, I'm not bothered about that. I just, um, I just need to be online and on air. And then I'll go into a second house in like a hidden location, um, one that has like a house specially made for me and like, like a temple house. That's how I, how I imagine it. And then I can have lots of different houses, big brother houses around with all different languages. And then um, you can play all of them in the, in the different languages. And um, it, I don't care which channel it goes on. Doesn't have to be ITV2 at that stage. I, I don't know. Um, and then um and then and then yeah i somehow um the next stages would be um just promoting my belief and seeing how people say and then um probably, probably there needs to be a hidden show for people who don't believe and a show that kind of just marks me or uh, whatever that show is um underground show or whatever i call it um i think that something needs to happen but what happens on it i don't know it will depend on what people want to see um and and then um i need to um talk to singers celebrities and find out the truth about what they know and and how you know where, where their inspiration for their songs came from and what they know about me or what they heard hear their story um and then i need to go online on the show with them um it doesn't have to be all on the same day or anything but over the over a period of few weeks um it, get them involved, give them their titles um, or tell the public what their titles are um, and how their song relates to those titles. And so when they sing, you know, they're not just singing for themselves, they're singing for the character that they they represent. Um, I'll only say the positive positive names at first. So Katy Perry is the intelligent side of God, nothing else. Um, and and then um, um, and then after that i'll probably insult the guys um and then i'll give them power by um through i don't know just um whatever um through some sort of false marriage maybe or something i, I don't really know that's that's just an idea um 
and and then um, and then the final stage is um, where oh I go into hiding and come back three and a half years later to reveal the negative names. Um, so yeah, that is what I think the plan is.